hi besties welcome to my channel welcome to yet another weekend vlog guys this weekend vlog is starting on a thursday on a thursday why because it's a long weekend you guys it's a long weekend okay i didn't even welcome you guys properly okay guys welcome to my channel if it's your first time here my name is neo i absolutely love you just for clicking on this video i love you already so hit the red subscribe button so that you become a part of the family and if you're a returning subscriber welcome back home bestie <laughs> tomorrow friday 11 november is poland's independence day you guys Pol plan was to braid my hair tomorrow unfortunately i wasn't able to get braiding hair yo i wasn't able to get braiding hair you guys which is such a bummer because when else will i get a chance to braid my hair <laughs> like, i really don't know where we or maybe i'll just retouch the hair i'll see anyway guys i just wanted to open this vlog would you cry or would you try to get me guys i'm so clean i'm so scorned <laughs> morning guys welcome to yet another day in the vlog welcome to friday guys right now i'm just going to make brunch because the time is 11 that noise is the washing machine because throughout the week i don't do laundry i usually wait for the weekend so that i just do it in bulk all the clothes that i wore during the week anyway let's go to the kitchen and make brunch finished eating and cleaning up now i just want a cold glass of coke i feel like nothing takes food down like coke right now is 20 minutes past 3 p.m and i've just been chilling since i had brunch not doing much really um there there are some important things that i should be doing but never being never i'm you know being a last minute person guys don't be like me anyway this is how it looks outside it's actually a really nice day i would i would actually go out and like just have a nice stroll in the park but I fear for my life. I fear for my safety. <laughs> anyway, right now, guys, I'm just going to have some chips, watch something. Anyway, what are you guys watching currently? Like, what's popping? What's the in thing? A lot of people went to watch Wakanda. Black Panther. Sorry, guys, if this makes me lose my passport to Wakanda, but I'm not a fan. But in general, not only of Black Panther, but the whole Marvel, what, what, what. The only um superhero to 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 what what movie that i've ever watched is deadpool i watched deadpool 1 deadpool 2 and that's yeah i guess that's like the only superhero movie i've ever enjoyed but black panther i tried watching black panther back in the day when the first one came out and everyone was crazy about it 
people wearing african print to the movies <laughs> sorry ask it, ask it. so yeah i tried watching it then when was that i think 2015 2016 don't quote me on that i could be wrong it wasn't interesting for me i tried i really tried so yeah this second movie is in i think there's also a premiere here in Vratov at Vratovia, the big mall the, my favorite mall i saw posters of black panther premiering but i'm like i'm not even moved but <laughs> anyway i'm just gonna find something to watch um on apple tv maybe apple tv is also very boring like the interesting stuff is done also i'm such a binge watcher so if there's a series that i like i find it i finish it i watch it in the same day that's my biggest red flag every nice series that's ever come out on apple tv last year i binge watched the morning show i binge watched ted lasso i binge watched tehran um Another one I binge watched last week was that criminal guy, Larry Hill, who, who's, he's still alive. It's based on a true story. He killed over 21 girls and he buried their bodies all over the U.S. It's based on a true story. So for me, when something is based on a true story, I just want to see what happens next. What happens next? Same with that whole Jeff Dahmer thing from Netflix. It wasn't interesting to me, but I just wanted to see what happens next. What happens next? What happens next? Anyway... Yeah, as you can tell, you guys, I don't even want to bore you with the rest of the day because I'm just going to watch something, eat chips, relax, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hi, besties. Hi, beautiful people. I should stop singing. Sorry for the horrible singing, guys. Anyway... I've actually been up for the longest time. The time is like 2 12 right now. I woke up, I took a shower, I tried to clean up a bit. As you can tell, I'm doing more laundry. Basically, my new ritual is to not go into the new week with anything in the washing basket. That's why I'm doing so much laundry this weekend. Luckily, yesterday was a holiday, so I did some. So today's just the last half. So this is literally my last load in from the washing basket. Anyway, guys, I've been awake. I'm chilling here because I was actually on a video call with my mom. I literally just no my mom called me i didn't call her she called me but then i used the chance to vent about how my hair is not ready my birthday is in six days i don't have time to do my hair during the week and even if i order a wig right now it won't be here by my birthday so what do i do and my mom is just like dude <laughs> like this is so not you like since when are you this person who worries about things she can't control and i was like damn actually like why am I why am I pretending to be this crybaby? Like that's not who I am. Okay, so yeah, me and my mom were just chit chatting about how fast time is flying. And she was just talking about how damn no, you were in high school six years ago. Like you realize how fast time is flying. Like damn, you're growing. Literally, it was just a conversation that went from me venting about my hair to how fast time is flying to how oh my gosh like if you haven't realized that now is the time to start living for you and not for other people then i don't know when else because time is flying you guys one day you're here the next day you're not here so hey child yeah that's pretty much what me and my mom were talking about what else did we talk about yeah birthday plans she was just asking me like so what's the plan for your birthday what are you doing and i'm like girl <laughs> this is the part where you ask me what's my account number so you can send me money for my birthday anyway guys <laughs> so i have a hair client today I, did i mention this before i think i did anyway i'll be doing one of my baby girl's hair i call her my baby girl because i've been doing her hair since she was three years old and now i think she's like seven six or seven basically i've been doing her hair for a very long time so um, usually I do her hair at her house, but today I asked for her mom to bring her here because as you can tell, I'm doing laundry, I'm doing a whole lot of things and I want to be able to do her hair and still housekeep at the same time, if that makes sense. So yeah, she'll be coming at 1pm. So I have about an hour to myself and usually when you're doing a kid's hair, you just need to prepare that it's going to spend the whole day because kids cry. No matter how many times kids do their hair, they still cry. So I take breaks when they cry i like i don't have the heart to continue braiding while a child is crying i don't know how people used to do it back in the day because i remember i also used to cry a lot i think that's why i have so much patience towards kids who cry when i do their hair because i also used to cry i remember guys my mom would hold let me demonstrate what can i use to a hair i'll use this teddy bear to demonstrate right put me my mom would put me between her knees like this and the more i cry 
she does like this like she 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 mm, you get what i'm trying to say so i don't know how people have the heart to continue breathing while a child is crying for me when the child cries i literally just stop i'm like okay let's take a break but i'm hoping because we'll be breathing here and not at her home she won't cry that much anyway enough about the baby and crying <laughs> right now guys i'm going to try and find something to eat and i'll see you guys when my little client gets here and honestly i'm not promising to do anything for the rest of the day because i'm probably gonna be tired after doing her hair and maybe i'll do something exciting tomorrow and i hope the weather is this sunny tomorrow and chicken oops little break for missy over here now i have a photographer hold for me okay kick and see no video okay oh my god wait wait <laughs> <laughs> who's not a ring light and i'm not gonna show my face are you gonna eat this rice i have to film I'm it i'm using the wrong thing to mix oh you have to use a spoon yeah. So this is my rice. I don't know why, but for some reason, I got creative and I added cream to it. And I'm not mad. It actually tastes really good. Guys, kids will humble you. After I made such a nice rice, you guys, she was like, um, actually, I don't want your rice. So she had noodles and chicken. And after that, we just went right back to braiding. There's literally like two braids left. So we're just finishing up, actually. and then i will wear this wig for i think three days since my birthday is on saturday my birthday is actually on saturday i feel like i should stop stressing like my hair won't let me down my hair wouldn't let me down like that anyway i'm opting to just wear the wig this week and then um i'll see what to do with my hair on friday so i know that at the beginning of this vlog i said it was going to be a weekend vlog but seeing as i didn't get up too much um i'll just make it a couple of weeks 
I mean, a couple of days in my life. Also, I don't know, birthday preparations. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. But I definitely will not be dropping it on Monday, which is tomorrow, because I want to give you guys proper content. You know, I just don't want to put out videos for the sake of putting out videos. So, yeah. Also, thank you guys, because our subscriber count is increasing. Our watch hours are also increasing. So you guys are watching, you guys are subscribing. So thank you guys. I don't really have like a, what do they call it? Sunday reset routine. But yeah, the time is like 19, 16 now. A few minutes past five, a few minutes past 7 p.m. And you guys, like at this time of the year, it's so hard to adjust. This is my fifth year experiencing like a proper, you know, that winter time switch. And I still fail to adjust year in, year out. I still fail to adjust. I have those days where I have no idea what to do with myself. Sometimes I just want to stay in bed. Suddenly you feel sad for no reason. Just because the sun just won't rise. Hmm. So yeah, I didn't do much today. It was one of those days. And this is me drinking warm milk. Oh, don't mind the nails. I'm going to fix my nails. Don't worry. Just pretend you can't see them. Anyway, drinking warm milk and cinnamon so I can sleep peacefully. I already took a shower, already freshened up. It's giving. Yeah. And yeah, that's it guys. Really, that's it. That's 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 today. That's life lately. <laughs> like we can't always have bubbly happy days, guys. So this is me today. And yeah, I'll catch up with you guys sometime during the week. Hi, guys. Guys, I just thought I should check in with you guys because the other day my vibes were just down. Anyway, so this is the week. And actually, it's not that bad. I feel like it's not horrible. Every time I wear it, I realize it's not that bad. It's not that bad. I was just having a bad day, honestly. Anyway, guys, um, today... Um, later on, I'm going to catch up with you guys. We're going to go to the mall because I want to check for Christmas pajamas, cute little pre Christmas pajamas. I'm not looking for pajamas that are going to break bank. So we're probably going to go to Pepco. Pepco Sensei. I checked online. Sensei has some for 49 bucks. And Pepco is obviously cheaper than Sensei. So I'll check Pepco first. And then if Pepco doesn't have, then I'll go to Sensei. If not, then I'll consider getting them online on AliExpress. But I don't know if they'll be here by Christmas. Anyway, guys, that's that on that. Also, guys, the Christmas market is coming this Friday. Guys, how crazy is it? Literally, guys, lately, I've just been feeling like time is flying. Like, when you're in the moment, you don't feel like the days are moving fast. But when you look back, you're like, damn. To the OG subscribers, to the OG subscribers, guys, how crazy is it that this week, last year, was literally me saying, I'm going back home to Botswana. Like, how did I go home, come back, and it's already been a full year? Like, how? Make it make sense, guys. How? Literally, I'll attach my birthday week vlog from last year. I was saying, guys, I'm so excited. I'm going somewhere after my birthday. Like, it's already been a year. It's already been a year since I went home. No worries, guys. Like, what? Time is waiting for no one. Anyway, of course, this year, I'm not going home. But yeah, last year was fun, man. Like going home for the first time after three whole entire years of being in Poland, not seeing my family, not hugging my mom. So yeah, last year was fun. I spent Christmas with my family, New Year's with my family. I spent Easter with my family. I was at home for like five and a half months. And that's because there was online classes. Like the situation favored me. But now um, <laughs> gotta be here. The girl gotta be over here. Anyway, yeah, guys, that's that on that. So I'll catch up with you guys later when i go to the mall just wanted to show you how the wig actually is not that bad you know it's really not that bad it's really not that bad it just needs a little shaping <laughs> i spent too much time on tiktok anyway see you guys later morning guys welcome to yet another day in the vlog guys not tomorrow being my birthday <laughs> today is zero degrees and it was actually snowing in the morning not much has been happening this week nothing interesting nothing, nothing to write home about basically <laughs> but apart from the fact that it's actually snowing right now like it just started <gasps> guys since 2017 right literally since 2017 it always snows on my birthday or on the eve of my birthday 
and for me i think that's like the most magical thing ever guys my comics is frozen <gasps> oh my gosh it's really winter it's literally frozen mm. i need to put it on the heater oh my god oh my goodness yo my fingers are freezing guys Woo! it's cold <laughs> Anyway, okay, enough about me ranting about the cold. <coughs> right, it's cold. Anyway, anyway, guys, so since tomorrow is my birthday, guess what also comes on my birthday? The Christmas market. So I don't know if I want to go to the Christmas market on the day that it opens. Because I'm guessing everyone is going to be excited. Everyone's going to be there. It's going to be full. It's going to be packed. So I might pass by just to show you guys how it is when it opens and stuff. So maybe that will be in a separate vlog. I actually hope you can hear me because there's noise. But we will be going to the mall later because on Tuesday, I told you guys that I'd go to the mall to look for pyjamas and stuff. I didn't get to go, unfortunately. So yeah, we'll be going today. Would you cry or would you try to get me? Tell me now. guys it's so christmasy like i know that every year they decorate for christmas but every year it still feels new again you know so christmasy like everything is so christmasy anyway you guys saw that sweater that sweater actually looks nice and it's only 40 bucks this sweater and black leggings would actually be a cute outfit a cute a cute loungewear christmas vibes outfit 40 bucks ladies do not walk to pepco run <laughs> anyway let me check for actual pyjamas mm, guys this looks super warm okay guys so here's a pair of pyjamas but they're only in the size small literally the last one Keep your friends together. It's a magical time. I don't even like dogs, but okay. I'm leaving Pepco now and I'm going to check Sensei. Anyway, going to the pajama section. It's the fact that they still have things on sale from the summer, guys. Guys, come and buy. Like, why are these things still here? <laughs> the pyjamas are just not giving. Let me show you guys. Like they're not giving at all. Guys, a bit disappointed because I was expecting to find nice PJs in Sensei because I believe in Sensei more than I believe in myself but Sensei's pyjamas are not giving like <laughs> ah, they look so funny this is a nice jacket has so many christmas sweaters but no pajamas no pajamas at all guys now i'm checking new yorker also guys things from the summer sales things from the summer sales are also still here like Guys, why are you not buying? Come and buy, guys. Things from the summer sale are still here in November. Oh, 
leaving New York now because <laughs> there's nothing. <laughs> Guys, for someone whose name is on a nail shop, my nails look so ghetto. <laughs> Guys, now I'm going to Natura. Since finding Christmas pajamas wasn't a success, I'm now going to buy hair gel because tomorrow is birthday. Yeah, me it's my birthday tomorrow, and I wanna do my hair nice, nice. And I know that Natura has a nice. I don't know if they still have it. This other gel. the gels there we go guys i used to use this gel so much extra strong i don't even know which one is stronger i used to use this one like as a woman whose birthday is tomorrow maybe i should start doing masks and stuff <laughs> Oh, could never be me. I feel like if I tried to be a self-care princess, it would last like for one day. Then I'll get bored. Anyway, maybe I should get one mask just to spoil myself and try. Just to try, you know, like new breath, new new age, new me. But how do you guys even know which products to buy? Like, how do you guys know which mask works for your skin? I guess that's it for me in the mall. I've been here for so long. That's it for me in the mall. I'll catch up with you guys when I get home. Hi guys, hi beautiful people. So I just got home. No, I actually got home like 30 minutes ago or even close to an hour ago. Cause I did spend quite a lot of time at the mall. There's not that much people, but you can tell that people have already started, you know, Christmas shopping, you know, people here take Christmas so, so seriously. And that's one of the things that I absolutely love about europe not only poland europeans in general they just take christmas so seriously like bachesta christmas like they bruh they take it super serious and i love that for them honestly anyway tomorrow okay birthday yeah I mean. <laughs> guys for some reason i'm like so unprepared for my birthday usually i'd have decorated my house by now i haven't even bought balloons I don't even know what my plan is. My nails are not done. Like, is this what happens like when you start growing older? Like, like very, very excited. Like I am excited to be growing older. If you know me, then you know that the anniversary of my birth is something that I take so seriously. Like I love my birthday so much, but I'm shocking myself how this year, like preparation, zero, 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 zero. Even my birthday pictures, I don't know, like, <laughs> I don't know what my plan is, <laughs> but we'll see. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video right up until the end. I'm going to take time to edit it right now so that I can put it out for you guys to watch. Do comment happy birthday now down below because I will be dropping this vlog on my birthday. Yeah, I'll be dropping this vlog on the 19th of November 2022. That's tomorrow. <laughs> so thank you so much, guys, for always supporting my content, viewing, liking, subscribing, everything. I love you guys so much. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.